Hi, I'm Chris with West Music, and I'd like to show you what a saxophone sounds like and how to put it together. One of the first things I always check with the saxophone case, if your case has one, um, is checking that I can see the label of uh, the instrument brand on top, just to make sure that I don't open the case upside down and spill everything out. Um, so if the label is showing, then I should be good to open the case. Um, first thing that I do is put uh, the saxophone neck strap on. We'll need that later to help hold the saxophone for us. Um, and then I'm going to take uh, the reed. This is a piece of cane, um, a type of wood. Um, a single reed is what makes the sound work on a saxophone. Um, this needs to be moistened uh, or soaked before it will make a sound easily. So while I'm putting the rest of the saxophone together, I usually just stick the reed in my mouth to kind of let that moisten. But for the purpose of uh, being able to still talk to you, um, I'm going to put it away for now. Just know that I would keep this uh, soaking until I had the rest of the saxophone together. Next, I'm going to take out the mouthpiece. This is a ligature. I'm going to put that aside for now and just work with the mouthpiece and then the neck of the saxophone. If you have cork grease, you can put a little bit of that on the cork of the neck to help the mouthpiece go on easier. I'm going to hold the neck of the saxophone um, as much as I can around the top piece so it's on the solid part. If you grab too much here or grab tightly, it can bend the top piece. So I just grab on the sides. I'm going to take the mouthpiece, put that on, I twist back and forth. Your director can help you uh, decide how far that should be pushed on. Um, but for now, I usually start around halfway. Then I'm going to take the, the rest of the saxophone, the body of the saxophone. Um, I always pick up by the bell and the body. I try to avoid, these are all rods, I try to avoid grabbing or squeezing here because you could bend certain things. So grab from the body if you can. I put the next strap, uh, hook it onto the loop down here. Take the body, the cap out, and then I can put the neck and mouthpiece that I have together in the top of the saxophone. And just kind of go back and forth, trying to line up this rib underneath the neck, so this top key here. And then I can tighten the neck screw, just make sure that doesn't move around. And the last step is taking that reed and ligature. Um, every ligature looks different, but all of them will have a narrower end and a wider end. So I put the wide end of the ligature on the mouthpiece first. Then I take the reed that I've been soaking. And I put that in the top of the mouthpiece. Between that and the ligature. I line the reed up left to right. Uh, so it's centered and also top to bottom. I should see maybe just a sliver of the mouthpiece above the tip of the reed. And then I tighten the ligature. Then whichever uh, playing position I'm comfortable in, I just use uh, the neck strap. I kind of raise that or tighten that um, so that it brings the sax to my mouth. The saxophone can play both high and low. Uh, it can play loud and soft, very versatile instrument. I'm really excited that you're considering uh, joining the band. Whether or not you choose saxophone, um, you can always stop on the West Music website or in one of our stores to get your new instrument. Play now, play for life.